Hey everybody. I've been having issues lately with my bunnies being very picky about their hay. And as we all know, hay is essential to help their gut stay moving and passing everything through so there is a low risk of GI stasis. This is a hay that we bought last fall from a local farmer. It's an orchard grass mix. And what they love about it is there is clover in it. And in the previous bales, there was a lot of clover in it. And it seems as we're getting to the bottom of the pile of our bales, it was probably from a different part of the field and there just is very little clover and they're not liking the rest of these grasses. And if you can't tell from the video, it's pretty brown and faded and the fragrant grassy smell has diminished and they just aren't eating a lot of it and that's not good. So I've been on the hunt to find them a good hay and the problem is here in Ohio, we have had the wettest June on record, I believe. So it's been difficult for the farmers to get out in their fields to cut the hay. There might be some first cutting available, but there is no second cutting, which is what I like to get, or third cutting. So what I have been feeding them is I do have some of this Small Pet Select Orchard Medley. It has some alfalfa in it. There is no clover in this. But what Small Pet Select told me when I inquired if it was coming back in stock is that the farmer that they used to get this from has retired so they don't think they're going to get it back in stock anytime soon that's what i was told so i was on the hunt for a new hay i want my bunnies to eat the hay and i just can't find anything locally yet so i tried farmer dave's pet supply they had a spring medley that i was sent a small sample of and my bunnies did like that. I didn't have much to try, so it was very difficult to test. And the shipping on a large amount of that made it very, very expensive. So I went to Small Pet Select and I decided I would try a couple of their other varieties that I have not tried yet. So I wanted to share with you what the two varieties I got from them looks like this time of year. So maybe it can help you decide if you want to try that for your bunny. And Hopefully it will help you if you are also having issues with a picky hay eater. So on the left we have a third cutting Timothy hay and on the right we have their orchard grass, both from Small Pet Select. This is 20 pounds over here and this is 5 pounds. However, it's not exactly 5 pounds and how do I know this? There definitely is not five pounds of hay in there because I know that box weighs well over 0.8 ounces. But anyhow, it's pretty close and the box is full. I do notice between these two here that the orchard grass, the one on the right here, definitely has a more obvious grassy fragrance and it does seem a little fresher. I don't know if that's actually the case. The Third Cutting Timothy doesn't smell bad, it just isn't very fragrant. It's pretty green. I think the bunnies will probably like it. These little taste testers are currently available from the two litters that I have. These are the last litters I will have all summer. They are Hazel's babies, two little does, and then the little buck is the broken chinchilla back here. So if you live near Northern Ohio or willing to travel for picking up here in Northern Ohio, you can head on over to ohiohollandlops.com and complete an application for these cuties. I also have another little buck from Cora's Litter who is available. They seem to like exploring it. I haven't seen them eat any of it yet. <laughs> They're so cute. Hi guys. No peeing in there. No peeing. Hi. So this is the little boy. Hi, sweetie. Oh, the little girl. This little girl has no fear. She's lots of fun. And so is her sister. She definitely is the most fearless. She's a little Charlie Chestnut, and then her sister is a solid chestnut. And this is the little broken opal buck from Cora's Litter, who is available. Really sweet little boy. Love his coloring.
Anna here is a picky hay eater. She loves the clover and it's hard to get her to eat other grasses. So if she eats any of this, it's definitely a win. She's definitely eating it. So is picky eater approved? I figured she would go for the more fragrant orchard grass, but nope, they're cutting Timothy, huh? Hopefully this video has helped you. If you also have a picky hay eater, like I do, but you're not sure where to order hay, this time of year it can be difficult because this is last year's hay most likely, especially with third cutting. So it is difficult to know, is it gonna be good quality or not? So here is Small Pet Select, Timothy third cutting, the orchard grass. After the next few days, I will have a better idea which one they like better, but I definitely think that there's a good chance they will like this. If you're interested in ordering, again, I advise try a small sample or a sample box. I will put a coupon down below if you would like to order from Small Pet Select. It'll save you some dough for your doughs or your bucks. Thanks for watching, everybody.